<laughs> why am I, why is that hole there? <laughs> like, yeah, explain to me why the hole is there. Hey, player. <laughs> Both turned around. <laughs> How are you feeling about the place? I was just saying, I didn't really know what to expect, but people say it's super cool and it's really nice. Like, it's like Gamla Stan, like the old town in Stockholm, but like a whole city. It's fucking cool. Back in my days, this wall didn't exist. <laughs> Yeah, it's a cool house. The vibes would be worth the, bu the bugs. I'm back, we are back to Visby Gotland after a few years. I actually shot some videos here, I think it was back in 2018, 19. And it's like a really cool space to be within because the entire gym is in like a massive silo. So they have like a lead wall, they have training area, they have the bouldering walls and the bouldering walls have really good angles. Uh, and this entire silo, this entire climbing space is located on Visbla, Visby Gotland. As you've seen from the footage, Visby, it's a super beautiful place. And it was really fun to just run around the city and showcase it a bit here in the intro. And you also saw like potentially the crew is bigger this time. So we have Tio is with us as always, Mickey, we have Nicken, and then we have Julia, uh, my better half that it's been, she was in the video I think a year ago. And then we have Vivi, and Vivi is one of the homies, she climbs a lot with uh, Tio and Mickey, and she is super strong, always super psyched, so I'm, I'm really happy that she would manage uh, to find time to, to join us for this trip to Gotland. I think that's it, that's the information we need before we're starting this video. So I'll just start the video, and uh, yeah, I hope you enjoy it. <laughs> you. <laughs> wait, wait, keep going. I'm gonna zoom in on just other faces. Should we turn around at the same time? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So, we're in the gym now, and the uh, game plan for the day is I'm gonna put up two problems. So, one of them is gonna be for Vivi and Yulia. So they're gonna get a really nice dynamic start, some kind of cool move, and then a really tricky, kind of scary, slippery slab. And then this overhang behind me is gonna be for me, Mickey, and Tio. So I'm gonna be using these white holds and green volumes and making just a super cool, powerful compression line. So um, just jump into it. I wanna get these up in 20 minutes, maybe. Okay. Pretty fast. So, first draft is up on the wall for the boys. We have uh, this white and green one behind me. So, some nice compression, you do some slapping, you have this cluster of three volumes, or the big, big white pinches, is around where the crux is gonna be. And keeping that tension, it should become some kind of desperate slaps. And then you enter up into like the more head wall section, and then it's just gonna be a little bit more delicate. Still compression, but more toe hooks and heel hooks. And it's gonna be green volumes, no? Yes. So I think uh, in the, yeah, it'll be fun. We're just gonna throw everyone on it at the same time. <laughs> First draft, and then we might like tweak it as we go. Yep. Maybe it's good to begin with. We'll see. So I'm gonna jump in and set the girls right now. And uh, we'll see. I think it, it'll go fast. I hope, I always say that though. Alrighty, the girl's problem is all done. So you have a nice little, there's actually, so there's two versions. So there's a version for Yulia, that's static. And then there's a version for Vivi in her style, which is more dynamic with coordination. And then after that is just weight shift and slopers and just finding the right position. And then a nice like big, big move to the top. I wanted to go for contrast with um, the aesthetic for this one. 
So you get the block boards, these super sharp jagged shapes, and then you get the contrast with the really big round gray ones. So you get like this hard and jagged and then like soft and roundish and nice. Um, but as far as climbing goes, the balls are just really good for standing on. And it is like if you relax, you're gone. So you have to have a lot of control over your feet and the hips and where the weight is. And then these holds are just, and then the block boards are just slopey enough where it really encourages that weight shift and finding the right balance. Because they're not too good, you can't just like yard on them because then you're going to come off. So it forces you to be delicate, which is, I like it. But All right, yeah. so who's the first victim? I think we're going to throw Vivi up on it first. She looks pretty ready and uh, excited. <laughs> Vivi, you're really good at jumping. So <laughs> I'm really keen to see you do this. You think you flash? Uh, no, because I'm very bad at flashing dinos, but I'm going to really try and flash. Oh, that's right. You do tell me you make like... <laughs> A hundred attempts before the sand. <laughs> Sometimes I flash the dinos, but this one I think is going to be hard to flash. Okay. But we'll see. <laughs> Got the psych from the from the boys. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I really, these types of things freak me out, but I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it for y'all. After your first go, the pressure is off, but the pressure is just mounting. Come here, Come here, Vivi! Fuck it, try hard! Too much sight! Yeah, it was really cool actually. Um, yeah, it was just a great boulder, thanks to Nikit. <laughs> Alright, so that seems like a good level. And uh, yeah, I will see Yuli on it as well. But it looks like that first move is exactly what I wanted. Mm. a nice boulder and set in like no amount of time what's the secret how do so... you do it <laughs> yeah, just like what's the secret okay because i'm afraid you know? okay so the secret is to look at your foot before you go because you don't want to miss it and then i kind of tried to stop my momentum for like like a really short period of time mm -hmm. to sort of have the time to turn around and plant the foot there and then I focus on the feet more than the hand. As soon as your foot lands, mm -hmm. you're going to automatically look up as a reflex. Yeah. So focus on the feet rather than where your hand oh, is going. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Oh. <laughs> 
Professional <laughs> climber. That's how you do it. Okay. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> Ah, glory! Yes. <laughs> yes. Oh. Like, how come the dyno thing? Like, how? Well, the reason I start, I, I always been a dynamic climber because I wasn't strong enough to lock off and climb statically, and I've never really had a lot of fear. And then I thought it looked cool as well, so I just wanted to try it out. And like when I see a dyno in the gym, I just make sure to try it, even if it's like super hard or super easy. Because I feel like you just feel cool when you stick a dyno. <laughs> yeah, it's nice, super satisfying. I don't normally uh, push myself to try dynamic moves, so it's nice to, to get one done. Have, have one in the tool belt, at least. The boy's been pushed. Yeah. <laughs> So what's the plan? Are you going first or are the guys going first? Nah, the guys are going first. Okay. Tio, you're going first. <laughs> why, am I, why is that hole there? <laughs> Nikki, <laughs> explain to me why the hell is there. That's a reason. There's a reason behind it. You get a couple more tries and then I'll tell you about it. <laughs> Woo! Come on, Nikki. You know what I mean? It's even worse than me. Watch it. I was about to sit past this shit. <laughs> yeah. I wish I could hop to another reality right now where I where that didn't happen. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh my god. Nails. Activate. So run up five minutes, do these tweaks. Keep trying it. How are you feeling about that? I feel good. It's the same feeling. It actually looks cleaner like this, which I quite like. But it's uh it should be the exact same feeling, just that you're going to a better hold. Ja, kom igjen, fortsett trykk! Ja! Yeah, 
that's a jug up there, but I like, I kind of missed it. Okay. But I'll do that quite easily next time, I think. Going down the mat. <laughs> wow. Super sick, man. Good work. Baby's first tow hook. <laughs> and it's, it's like a sinker jug tow hook. <laughs> I'm like, a million tweaks so that Mickey can send. But, you know. But, wow. Oh my god, dude. I haven't been this happy about doing a move in a long time. Oh. Oh, I got super happy with the feeling though. That's awesome. A good flow, constant tension until the very last move. So we'll see. So now we'll see uh, Mickey and Tijuana and they're definitely getting closer. Unlocking the moves, unlocking the positions. Mickey's learning how to tow hook. Big things are happening. <laughs> 